Hi guys, welcome back to Mamma Mia DIYs. I'm Jackie. If you're new here, welcome. I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you today. Uh, most of the stuff that I picked up is going to be used in doing gift bags or gift boxes, basket ideas for you guys. So, let's get started. First thing I got is this cute little, they call it a wine glass, I think. Well, it doesn't really say, but I pick two up every season that they have because I like these. And this is Tis the Season. And I'm looking for the complete set of this. They only had four of the dessert plates or appetizer plates. And I need like 10 of the dinner plates and these plates. So hopefully I can find some more of these. So I'll pick that up. Uh, let's see. I found these. These are Great Sense Charcoal Odor Neutralizing Beads. So they're in this cute little pineapple shaped thing. Thought I'd give these a try with winter coming on, everything closed up, musty, smelling. Thought I'd give these a try. So I picked up two of these. I also found some more essential oils. This time was flower citrus, apple cinnamon, lavender fields, and vanilla. These, I'm going to do some homemade bath salts and use those in there. Oh, sorry guys. I picked up some of these napkin rings out of the, um, here it's kind of a glare, I'm sorry, the party section just to have on hand. I picked up several of the chalk board tags out of Crafter Square. I'm going to use these for my gift ba baskets and then I picked up the heart one. Also for the gift bag, some double-sided tape and some mountain foam, also out of the Crafter Square section. I saw these cute little bows. I thought those were cute. Don't know what I'm gonna do with them yet, but always find something for Christmas. So in my last video, I talked about doing some fake presents to put outside and I talked about wrapping them up and wrapping them in cellophane. Then I thought about tablecloths. My theme outside this year, I wanna just do mainly red and whites. So this was over in the kitchen section. It is, just says a tablecloth, plastic, 54 inches by 100 and eight inches. And I picked up two of these to make my little fake presents to set outside. I did find the Palmer's uh, Melt Away Chocolately Treats. I picked up two boxes of these to near uh, the Cocoa Station. Have those ready for when the grandkids come over. I picked up two boxes of the Entertainment's Hot Chocolate Original K-Cups. There's three per box. So I picked up two boxes of these. That's going to go along with the gift bag ideas. And I found this cute bug. It says, don't get your tinsel in a tangle. I thought that was so cute. And then the other one. Tis the season. And set all the stuff off to the side, trying to make sure I got it in there. I picked up some Swiss Miss hot chocolate with marshmallows, some Pop Weaver kettle corn. You get three in a box. So pick those up to go along with my gift ideas. I picked up two of these cute little cardboard houses. This one's got ginger, it looks like a gingerbread house and gingerbread man all around it. And this one just says candy cane painting, 
Merry Christmas. Welcome to Santa's workshop. So I thought these were cute just to set up as decor or you can take the top off, kind of glue it to the side, put some treats in there. It could be a, a cute little gift. I picked up one of these cooking concepts mixing bowls for a gift idea. We've got the cooking concept whisk and put down in there. The little tongs. See, I'm sticking with the red and white. The little mixing spoon. A little spatula. Uh, Betty Crocker scraper. It's got a big scraper on one end, a smaller one on the other end. The Betty Crocker measuring spoons, a red spoon rest, and some cooking concept measuring cups. So put all that in there, and you could get some. Um, cookie dough put in there. I also have, I don't know what I've done with it, but I picked up some cookie cutters. Oh, they're over there on the other end of the table. So, I've seen everybody been hauling these since way back in the spring. I have never been able to find them, and that is the 3D, what are they called? Yeah, the 3D wreath forms. I found it in the large size and then the smaller size. So that was a great find. I have been searching and searching for those and could not find them. Let's uh, see. I finally found the mini natural pine cones. I found them one scented with cinnamon. But uh, my husband doesn't like smelly stuff that often, so I didn't want to overwhelm me during Christmas with all the cinnamon smell. So I've got the plain, and then I picked them up in the frosted. So got those. And I picked up this to make another gift basket idea for the movie lover that you have on your list. And then these two little popcorn cups that comes two in a set and some other ideas that's going to go along. I promise you I will be doing that DIY. Some um, Ritz Bits made filling with real cheese. Those and the mini Oreos. And I found this. It's Betty Crocker single serving mug treats. I found those and I thought that would go good with Tis the Season. You can make a little gift set out of that for someone that loves chocolate. And I found some Alpine Spice Apple Cider. Love apple cider on a cold day. And the other stuff that I got here is for the dog lover and on your list. I've got two dogs and I got a grand dog. And they get stockings at Christmas time, just like all the rest of us. So I found these are oven baked chicken jerky strips, dog treats. Greenbrier Kennel Company. So I picked up two of these, one pack for my dogs and the other pack for the grand dog. And these are by Loving Pets, Nature's Choice, Sweet Potato and Duck Stick Recipe. And it looks like little beef jerky sticks. So two packages of these. I picked up two Water Buffalo Ear Natural Dog Chew. So, my dogs love these. Oh, there's a glare. There you go. Just, they love chewing on those. My littlest one, she will take it from my other dog. And I got 
Watson, Loving Pets, Nature's Choice, Chicken Wrap, Sweet Potato Biscuits. And they're little doll treats with, with like bacon wrapped. So I picked up two packages of these. I uh, found these. These are Foppers Gourmet Pet Treats Bakery. And they're just little dog treats that look like the little milk bones. Pick those up for my dogs. And then I picked up two of these. And these look like, I guess they're supposed to kind of look like a pretzel. Kind of look like a heart shape. And they've got, looks like sprinkles in them. So I picked up two of these to put in their stockings for Christmas. And the last thing that I got for the dog lovers are... Karina Alpo T-Bones. My little Pookie, he loves these, so I'll pick those up for him. I also picked up two rows of this gift wrap. I'm going for a more rustic cabin feel Christmas, so saw these. I'll pick this up. And let's see. And then I found these these are the yardsticks sorry guys they're all kind of stuck together I picked up the snowman and it's got a little snowflake that things around so these are going to be setting outside in my flower beds out front so I picked up two snowmen I picked up two of the little penguin thought they were so cute and then I picked up two of the Santa Clauses I just thought but you know they hadn't put them out yet because they were still in the box and they were still had the plastic on it. But they got to keep the plastic because they're always getting stuck on one, end, one another. So I'll pick those up. So let me get reach over here and get the cookie cutters. <laughs> Sorry guys. So I found the cooking concept cookie cutters. And it's a star, a heart, a circle and the gingerbread man, but if you turn the gingerbread man upside down, kind of looks like a reindeer, so either way. So I'll pick those up to put in my little cooking gift set that I'm gonna make. Well, that's all that I have for you today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please subscribe, share this video, Leave a comment down below. In the past, I've been asking a question. Uh, this time, let's see. I can't think of a question at the moment. So I guess I'll just wrap it up with that, guys. I'm sorry, I just don't have a question. I've been kind of MIA for a little bit. I went on vacation, had to go back to work. It's crazy life trying to get things done so hope you like this video subscribe thumbs up like comment help me build my channel you guys have a blessed day bye